Sheriff Joe to Trump, where's my support? Joe Arpaio, the controversial former Maricopa County, Arizona, sheriff, lamented the lack of support from the current administration after his conviction in U.S. District Court on charges of criminal contempt, according to Infowars.com. Where is President Trump on this case? Arpaio asked during an interview with the website. Arpaio was an early supporter of President Donald Trump, endorsing his candidacy in January of 2016, saying Trump was ready to get tough in order to protect American jobs and families, and that I know Donald Trump will stand with me and countless Americans to secure our border. Trump's campaign issued a statement at the time, accepting the endorsement and adding, we must restore law and order on the border and respect the men and women of our police forces. I thank Arpaio for his support of my policies and candidacy for president. The White House response to Arpaio's conviction has been silence. This is a witch hunt against me that is being carried forward by Obama holdovers and Attorney General Sessions Department of Justice, Arpaio said. America's toughest sheriff could face up to six months in jail when he is sentenced October 5, according to the Los Angeles Times. Arpaio defied a judge's court order in 2011 to refrain from arresting people suspected of being illegal immigrants. Arpaio's attorney said the original 2011 court order was not clear, and Arpaio maintained that he never intended to violate it. Prosecutors contend that Arpaio's actions were deliberate. The defendant thought this day was never coming. But nobody gets to defy a federal judge's order, said prosecutor John Keller in a report from CNN. Arpaio was Maricopa County Sheriff from 1993 to 2016, when he was defeated by Paul Penzin. His tenure as sheriff was controversial from the start. He was the subject of headlines and profiles when he constructed the infamous Tent City, a makeshift structure adjacent to the Maricopa County Jail to house inmates in the sweltering Arizona sun, and when he forced inmates to wear pink underwear, a move he claimed saved the county $70,000 in its first year. Arpaio also questioned the authenticity of President Barack Obama's birth certificate. What do you think? Scroll down to comment below. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe 24 hours channel. Goodbye and see you again.